Alright, so Nas, we're gonna compare all these mid range speakers. Nas up to $50. So this guy is gonna be $36 per pair. Reason why I'm doing this before you guys trashing my channel, I'm gonna show you what kind of signal you're getting and the, how's the regular speaker is gonna work. So I have a, the regular uh, Sony camera so you can see close up views, what's going on with the speakers, and that camera is gonna be overall whatever you've you seen. So I have a $36 speaker right here. I have a PRV audio. That's the cheap, uh, the cheaper version. So this it's gonna be for pair $47, but the price is gonna be fluctuated, right? The Ryan, um, I want to test this. I have a if you watch if you didn't watch my previous video, definitely go ahead and watch it. So you're gonna see it. I have a Ryan here. Let me put this one here. I have Ryan here. This one is a $50 per pair. So I have a three of them. I have this guy the cheaper and the $90 per pair and $120 per pair. So I have this guy here. I have a Rockwell. I always impress from this company. They, they, they're making the good products, okay products. Like uh, uh, some people like, a lot of people hate about this company, but uh, the build quality is not bad. So we're going to compare these guys also. This is $37 per pair, right? And. The Challenger is the DS18. So DS18, this is the cheaper version of DS18. So it's gonna be comparison with this uh, as we go PRV. So we're gonna see the sound output. Now uh, these guys is mid-range speakers. So I'm gonna run them. I have uh, like more than 20, 22 speakers. Uh, again, watch my other channels uh, how I unbox it and explain it all this. If I run each speaker with the, each other, it's going to be more than like a 2,000 videos, right? So what I'm going to do, the $50 separate, $80 separate, $120 separate. And I'm going to choose the best ones from that and we're going to find the, like a UFC, right? We're going to do UFC here with the speakers. I'm running my microphone all the way back there so I can run maximum power uh, from the speaker. So it's, you're going to see it. When I'm going to start running these speakers compared with each other, I'm going to do it in the box. So they properly install it and with the box with the best speakers. Now I have no time to install each speaker like 10 times to the box. That's why I'm doing the open air test. I have a $260 speaker. The build quality is exactly the same thing with this $50 speaker for pair. $265. Just the name, it's Hertz, Hertz, right? Hertz, whatever you call. That's why I'm keeping here. So when I'm comparing with these guys, I'm gonna do this guy too.
I like this. <laughs> you finally like it, I like it. Guys, I'm not gonna advertise. This is, I pay my cash. I'm telling all my videos. I have a couple companies, they, they want to send this uh, speakers, but they say, your video is, doesn't have a script, so we're gonna give you the script. So as soon as I heard that, like, you, you know, stay away. Stay away, I'm gonna buy online, so I'm gonna compare the speakers, right? I, I don't need your script. I'm just set up my, uh, you know, the cameras, and I'm gonna, hear the difference and I'm gonna tell the guys what is right and what is good look at the sound quality on this one and look at this one right you see the difference right this guy is good PRV more clear and as a mid bass it's playing like a mid bass <laughs> this guy's sounds good I was uh, like surprised when I connect my Pioneer like like bright nice sound is coming like right away from the speaker right it's the same scenario here so let, let's do it so same music okay okay Everybody waiting this. Everybody waiting. This. I, I I know. These now it's gonna be like blow these speakers four times. Right. Has to blow it because four times the price. Build quality on this one's better. Same portion. Are you guys ready? This guy is more clear, but mids on this one is louder. Looks like this guy.
hard to say that you, you see that like four times four times the price and I'm, I'm sitting comparing two speakers which one is better of course this uh, the middle punch is louder on this but this guy I'm gonna compare with the expensive ones so Nas the Chipitos so clarity wise Nas like I'm, I'm running the, not the, the high volume Nas every speaker I'm gonna run higher volume but different song so maybe this song is good so what we're we gonna do we put everything here and we're gonna adjust the sound the volume on this guy baby skin drier and healthier the health of your baby now you're gonna see a lot of jumps Jump. If you have a regular speaker, it's gonna jump like that. That's we're getting the full sound. Of course, you shouldn't give any of these speakers that the full sound because these are mid bass, so you're gonna tune your frequency response. Some of them it's gonna start from 65, 85. Uh, these ones are like almost at like 90,000 uh, hertz. That's why you're gonna um, adjust the frequency response, but what I'm doing is the, the main of point of my channel, right? Before the trashing all kind of, you know, stupid comments, I'm going to run all these, the sound quality, we're going to pull up which one, and I'm going to install the best one to the box, and in the box we're going to test them. The reason why I'm doing the open box, now it's no reason to me to test uh, this guy, right? It's $37, but it's, I'm not going to screw like 10 times this guy. That's why I'm doing all these crazy uh, experiments. Same music, same same portion, we're gonna run it. You see that, right? One more time. So, let's start. Really nice to, to hear this, uh, li listen to this, like. It's RV baby <laughs> good job guys so Challenger DS18 same spot same like <laughs> now you guys see me how I'm giggling like other videos I'm sitting like when playing the loud like I'm ah 
that that's what's happening like some speaker is gonna make you I think this PRV gets a little louder. And this guy, $37. You got what you paid. So guys, I gotta shoot the conclusion. Conclusion is Ryan, uh, more natural sound. I like to have the Ryan's uh, sound outputs. If I buy the speaker for my personal use, not to show off like the competition, I'm gonna go with the Ryan, it's 100%. The more sound quality, the sound quality is better. PRV is a louder speaker. It's exactly like mid-bass, uh, the mid-range mid speaker. It's tuned for mid-range, so if you put the like an eight of them and blast the sound, it's gonna be really loud because it's gonna be mid. It's the mid is like the perfect on the PRV. Uh, the S18 overall is good sounding speaker. If you just replace that, uh, the sp you know the four four door speakers and it's gonna get loud and it's a little bassy because it goes lo lower on the bass. It's still gives the more bass but it doesn't get the distortion but it doesn't have it's a full range speaker but it's not uh, higher than Ryan the Ryan is a more natural sound some reason I don't know so it's that that's my choice but the PRV is number one Ryan is number two and DS18 is number three number four is gonna be Rockville I have a Lanzar is it, it's coming and I have a sound stream is coming and I have a GP something it's also the 50 50 dollar range I'm gonna shoot those guys also so I'm gonna show you which one is gonna be better this is like a uh, the first punch maybe DS18 is gonna be the best than the sound stream all the other speakers right I have a four ohms and eight ohms setup also later on I'm gonna test four ohm versus eight ohm. So you guys gonna see it. If you didn't subscribe to my channel, guys definitely subscribe it. Uh, I appreciate it. You guys uh, supporting my channel is very good. Uh, I, I I have fun to reading the comments. And thank you very much, guys. Uh, see you on the next video.